Hi everyone, welcome to Breast to Earth. Literally means the arm of water. Apparently you could see all the way down to the sea down there. And, well that's Ricky, <laughs> yeah. But there was a sea, you could see it. And it sort of looked, made the shape of an arm. Well there is still a sea. The sea is still there. I'm not sure if it makes the, the shape of an arm. Maybe you have to see it from this perspective because it definitely doesn't look like it from Google Earth. But as you can see, I've got Ricky with me. And we're starting with the old sugarcane mill. Uh, you'll notice that Ricky will disappear from time to time to see if anyone's making comments. Hi, Ritish. Hi, guys. <laughs> so as it pops up, she'll be able to see it. Uh, that's her there. Uh, so we won't be able to see your comments because we got it on the wide angle so we can show you more but I will flip the camera around in a second just want you guys to make sure that you know you're on the right channel you are with with us <laughs> walking around so now I'm going to turn the camera around and we'll be able to see what you guys are seeing ah, there we go look at that that's the actual stone the stonework, it's, it's actually really good stonework. I mean, I, I'm not supposed to be telling you about this. This is all about forests and stuff, but this is really good lime mortar that they've actually put over it. Good morning from, hi Daniel Noble. <laughs> hi Ratish. <laughs> Sorry, didn't mean, didn't mean to forget about you guys. I, I've turned the camera on so I can actually see your comments. This is the visitor's center and they've got some animals over there. Uh, giant tortoises but they're a little bit in cages so it's a bit yeah so we don't we don't show giant tortoises in cages but this is on the way to the park the visitor center is very very helpful um, super friendly super nice loads of great information yeah very very nice there is tons of stuff on there they're trying to reforest this whole place and there's a bit about the sugar mill and a bit about the old train uh, it really is really is a fantastic visitor center but you're not allowed to video in it you have to get special permission so, I'll just film this. Look at that. What a great place. Good morning from UK. Okay, uh, that was Daniel. Was it Daniel? This would be Jane and Craig, I think. Okay. I know it's, <laughs> the one I'm seeing is. Oh, okay, Danielle. Danielle, sorry. <laughs> anyway, there's some fish here, so I'm going to show you some fish. The water is a little bit murky but you can see the fish in there yeah very tanniny leaves this is like the citron river yeah <laughs> yeah yeah anyway old sugar mill yeah there's actually a sign that says the old sugar mill so i don't see a tower but this sugar mill was started in about 1840 yeah and it was one of the first to use indentured labor but originally it was from a farm. So, danger rocks falling. Now, the, the, the interesting thing about this, you see this is ground level, right? Why does it go underground? What secrets are under there? What do they hide in the basement of the sugar mill? Yeah. Brasta O, correct. Yes, it's Brasta O. Place. It is, Ian. It's actually really, on a, it's actually a really hot day. Yeah, it is scorching hot, but you wouldn't be able to tell that from having a look here. In the forest you just get some humidity. Yeah, it is a little bit humid. <laughs> a lot humid. Breast oh nursery. We mm -hmm. lagging. Yeah, no, we We died. <laughs> move, move. We're gonna move. We obviously in a bad spot. But, so that's me on the wrong side. I will flip flip it around because it is a bit murky. So <laughs> here we go. Back around. Wow, that, that's what we're heading to, that. It's a, it's, I think it's a reservoir, but it might just be a well. So everyone who we dropped, sorry about that. Welcome back. It is a main road here. This is the road between Poster Flack and uh, uh, the other place. Where is Tammy? Tammy is there in the picnic area. <laughs> There's Tammy, chilling out in the picnic zone <laughs> with a little friend. Found yourself a little friend. Size doesn't matter to Tammy. Whoa, whoa. Drop my camera. <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. Drop my camera. Uh, we're going to try and get to Puts Francis. 
don't know what Pitz Francis is, but we're crossing the road here. Francais. Francais. I think it's a root. Okay. Which means root. Okay, so we're here. I'm going to hand the camera over to Ricky in a second because we're not sure about the, the goodness of the, the picture. But we're going to go down there. So uh, I don't know how far we can go. Oh, you can step. Let's just help Ricky down a bit. They're very big steps. Very big steps. I'm just going to turn the camera a bit. And we're going there. Your post got 20 likes and 14 comments. I don't know what that's all about. Ricky says that matters. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the guy ghosted his brother. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So we're going into this. If we drop signal again, uh, I'll bring the camera out. But I do want to go in there. This is the building. It is square, but inside it's round. And now it's starting to rain a little bit. So down the stairs we go. Woo. <laughs> okay, it looks like we still got signal. We got this. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to hand the camera over to Ricky. But look up there. Ta da It's round. It is round. And so, one of the most classic shots in Mauritius that you can get. Wow, and it is raining now. There we go. There we are. Hole in the sky. Wow. Get your screenshots. This, I think, is a reservoir, Ritish. It's, it looks like a well. I'll bring it down here. It's a well, I think. Inside there is a well. You can see water. But I think it's a reservoir because it's square on the outside. So, not a well, but there is this. So, I'm going to hand it over to Ricky. So, she can watch me lift this up. You guys are still there. Hey, there's water down there, and it actually it gets deeper. It actually looks like there's a river. A river running through. <laughs> oh, and there's a ladder. Okay, just I'm gonna hold this and go down the ladder. No. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? It's a yeah, it's a Brian Hall in in the middle of this beautiful well. Uh, how cool is that? Mm. You have to really bend. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, wow, hey? How awesome is this though? Okay, we're gonna go up because there are tons of ruins here. This is the, this is not a ruin. I'll show. I'm gonna just, <laughs> hang on guys, I'm just gonna walk you up, showing me because, well, you, you know. Turn my back to <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. All I can see is Ricky's butt. Actually, the camera is right up, almost up against it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, so that's it, but you see it's square, round in the middle. And there's no way, I'm going to go around it a little bit, see if there's, you see we saw the windows from the, the inside. Oh, what's that? Maybe it's a jungle gym. I have no idea what that is. Anyway. <laughs> it's raining. It's raining, it's surprise raining. <laughs> oh, my glasses are getting a bit wet. It actually is raining mm -hmm. when you take your glasses off. We'll go find some more forest to walk in. Hopefully the rain will stop in a minute. Okay, I'm going to turn you guys around. Uh, so you can see what I'm seeing. Whoa. Whoa. Uh, hello, who's that? <laughs> Dive in, no. <laughs> Brendan, do we have children? No, we don't have children. That's we are, why we are each other's children. <laughs> well, I'm mostly the child. <laughs> and he's enough of a handful. Yeah, so doesn't need any more than that. So this is the forest. Now apparently there is a piece of ebony left here. And well an actual tree. Yeah. An actual ebony tree. There's one left as far as I know. But I don't know if we'll ever find it. I'm sure they've hidden it from everyone. Oh I'm sure they must do. Is the basement to the mill? I think so, Maybe. I think so. That's where they could come out or something. <laughs> yeah. But look at all this. There are so many of these old ruins. Oh, and while you're walking past there, you can see these like sheets of basalt. Okay, that. The geologists out there. Because this area was a lava flow area. Brandon, it is a nice area. It is a very nice area. It's gorgeous. And there's very, there's some short hikes, there's long hikes. And it is very peaceful. It's so, well, apart from the 
the so noise of the road. A bit away from it for many. Yeah. But yeah, now you can talk about the dwellings. These are all houses, genuinely. Some of them were barracks, and they weren't barracks for soldiers, they were barracks for people. So you would have your, your laborers coming here and they would stay in the barracks until they got married or they got together with some friends. And then they would go out and uh, build a little house. You can't see them here, they're the small ones like that. That one there is about 20 square meters. So that would have probably been a little smaller house. They would have had like a family, a mom, a dad and a couple of kids. Wow, it's really raining a lot yeah, now. No okay, we're gonna head for that. There's a pagoda there. So we're gonna walk rapidly towards the pagoda. Uh, just wish there was a shortcut. And for anyone who's interested, there are monkeys here. We did see a monkey. <laughs> and for those who are thinking it, no, it wasn't me, it was a genuine monkey. Yeah, little one, it was cute. Yeah. So you can see we are getting a little bit wet. So it's nice about rain and it's not cold. Yes, no, it is nice. We were, we were at Belmar earlier and we got drenched, completely soaking wet. And about an hour later, we were completely dry again. Okay, so there's a nature trail there, but we're actually heading towards the pagoda. Wow, the back is not easy to walk up. Ricky's struggling a bit back there. <laughs> but have a look at these. This is, this is the actual buildings. And there are so many of them. You see them all piled up. And you think, oh, wait a second. That's just a rock formation. No, it isn't. It's someone's house. There are tons of them here. Well, it was someone's house. <laughs> yeah, well, it was someone's house. No one's living in it anymore because we're traipsing all over it. Okay, pagoda in sight. Pagoda in sight. Ah, that's what I mean by pagoda. I don't mean anything fancy. And it is a little... You're alive. Everyone, sorry about the, the loss of signal who have abandoned have come back now I had to go outside because this what's the problem that's the pagoda and it's a bit dark but there's a Ricky in so everyone who came to join sorry about that but we are now back out in the forest <laughs>